It's going to be a tough day in Grand Forks as the community says goodbye to a slain officer, Cody Holty, who died last week in the line of duty. The Valley Today's Abby Furchner is live from Grand Forks this morning from where the funeral will be taking place this afternoon. Good morning, Abby. Good morning. I'm outside of the Ralph Engelstead Arena where we just saw a group of soldiers making their way in through the front entrance and them joined with uh, law enforcement around the area. And of course, many community members are going to be inside the Ralph Engelstead Arena today as we pay our respects and honor Officer Cody Holty. I talked with Lieutenant uh, Derek Zimmel yesterday with the Grand Forks Police Department, and he said that the entire Grand Forks agency plans on being on in, in attendance today, along with multiple law enforcement agencies around the area. And if you're not attending, uh, a lot of them are going to be helping out as well. I know North Dakota Highway Patrol and UND Police plan on taking over those calls for service as Grand Forks officers are going to be inside at that time. Now, I know know too that both the public is or the public is allowed to join both the visitation and the funeral the visitation visitation begins at 10 a.m today with the funeral beginning at 1 p.m this afternoon followed by the procession between 3 and 3 30 this afternoon and lieutenant zimmel wants to remind the community to expect traffic delays and to please respect them at this time but i wanted to read a powerful statement from holty's family that they released over the weekend it said we'd like to thank the community for the overwhelming outpouring of support the messages well wishes and prayer for cody and our family are a source of comfort in this time of sadness and grief. Cody was an incredible husband, father, son, brother, uncle, police officer, and soldier. The list could go on and on. The impact he had on his family, friends, and colleagues was immense, and he will be missed dearly. You can also donate to the Grand, the Grand Forks Police Department, secured a memorial fund for the family. That, con that information is up on your screen. The fund is affirmed by the police department and will only be accessible to Holty's family. And of course, if you can't attend the funeral today, we will be live streaming it on KVLY and on our website as well. But it's going to be a hard day Thank here you. in Grand Forks. All right, Abby Furchner, yeah, a lot uh, going on, and we will be live streaming that on KVLY and on valleynewslive.com as well. Abby, thank you.